Hey everyone, how are you doing? Martin here, one hour playthrough. Welcome back to Fallout 4, where we play the Nora mod. And I would like to start by giving a shout out to Arcane Hermitude. He left comments on every uh, video I created so far for this series. And the last comment was, um, he really thought it a shame that I didn't continue the series. Well, I want to continue the series. I was just really busy with the long dark, and I don't know if it's a good excuse, but it's the way it is but and this is why I love to hear from you guys um, comments like this really gives me the incentive to say all right listen now I really need to get going and continue with the stuff I'm working on so hence come on Fallout 4 on video and we will continue the series for sure all right so thank you arcane and another thing Arcane actually pointed me to is the iHUD mod and what you can see is that my HUD I don't have a HUD I have a little dot in the middle right now and it's a really really great mod uh, you can get it via Nexus check it out if you like if you want to be emerged in the screen uh, I removed many things uh, my health bar will be shown at 90% my HP bar will be shown at 90% I can understand that some people really find this pretty annoying do let me know if this is good or if you don't like it um, and what you don't like about it um, I really appreciate that feedback so I can make some adjustments so you guys can still watch the videos with pleasure all right Having said that, there is this little raider camp which we could try to take out. For example, Notice this guy here. Alright, he's gone. There are two raiders there. Let's try to get him. And then, let's check out the missions first. So we're going to hand in the first step, then we go to Sanctuary and talk to Preston, and then that's it for for Preston. Um, we're probably not going to go back to Sanctuary, or not any time soon at least. Let's get this guy. I really missed. I already found a new gun. He doesn't even know where I am. There we go, we ninked. Good stuff. Alright, what I want to get out of the way is uh, I'm going to do the local leader perk. Uh, it's going to be in come in handy. Uh, because while I have, will have some kind of main base and linking them all together for resources for building. That will be pretty easy. There's something a bit All right. Off. So we, what we have left is a raider and a turret. So I let's find you. this. No thanks. You can trust me. Ah. Come on, come on. Also, I have a new graphics card. I bought the the Asus GTX 1060. Where that little fucker? Something, go? something. <laughs> There's something more to it. Alright, there you go. Alright, so only this guy. Alright, we clear this area. Good stuff. Let's quickly take all the loot. I think I'm almost over encumbered though, so... A glow-sided heavy... Well, it's a glow-sided. We already have this hunting rifle. Great tip. Um... Loot every gun and you can drop it later, but by looting the gun you take out the ammo. And this is a way to get a really decent amount of ammo. Of course, Scrounger, the perk, is really good for that as well. Alright, let's see. Oh, we can. Expert already unlocked. Nice. Oh my goodness. There we go. Yes. Take the lot. Already too heavy. Alright. Always what you loot from a safe um, is a gun. Always happens. 
Alright, let's see. We're all good here, but I'm well over encumbered. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to take a buff out. Yeah. Very properly hydrated. Because I'm pretty sure that Nora okay. is full. Right. And try. Yeah, and dog meat is full as well. So, alright, let's get going. We have... What's this called? I always think it's Twin Peak, but there's something peak. Mystic Pines, that is. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that. Alright, let's get this. Um, I do need the bottles. Um, to replenish my... I think we're going to sleep as well. Uh, purified water. Yeah, we're going to have a sleep. Hang on. There we go. Uh, the buff out will stop though. That's a fortunate. Let's do four hours sleep. Okay, yeah, the buff out has worn off. That's really a shame. Alright. If we get addicted, we'll see about that. Um, behind this door is a fusion core. I'm not going to grab it right now. It's just too heavy and I don't need it. I have no immediate plans for power armor. Nice. As it is. That's a different type of gameplay. And I have a feeling it doesn't really fit. Oops. In this uh, particular playthrough. There we go. Some more bottles here. Which I will grab. Happily. There's another one here. Nope. Oh. Some glue. Remember at uh, Sanctuary I'm going to do some upgrading for the new uh, rifle. I have, I have a hunting rifle. need to put the scope on it. But first, oh, and the compass. The compass should be visible. It's not visible when drawing a gun. Well, this gives me an opportunity to show you how this mod actually works. In the MISC at the bottom we have a settings for e the immerse hot, Im immersive hut. Oh my goodness. Can't talk. Go to the compass and while the weapon is drawn, I want to have a compass. There we go. And I said that it needs to disappear immediately. Yeah, I like that. Alright, let's get some mole rats because I think a little bit further up ahead is this little shack which always has this mole rat event. Yeah, I can already see it. This dude is uh, in a little bit of trouble. Let's see if we can save him. Let's do this. Might get a legendary here. Maybe. I don't think that's all of them. Yeah, it seems so. Alright. Alright, just going to take the meat this case Not because over there. there he is. Also we'll be over encumbered really really fast. Next perk will probably be spent in uh, one hand. Already carrying too much. Let's see if I can get rid of something. My goodness, so many of them. They can give you a disease. Oh no no no! What the? Mm. Just <laughs> so many of them. And Nora thinks it's great. If you have just tuned in to this video, you haven't seen other videos. We're testing this Nora mod and see what what type of remarks she all comes up with. 
Right, and let's get some antibiotics. Alright, we're still over encumbered. Not by much, so what we could do... I think we already have a buff out, so let's take a little drink. Let's go in here. Let's get even more over encumbered. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I love it when Dogme does that. That's why I let it go and not shoot. Alright, so we have a baseball bat we don't need. Um, more meat Ugh, and loot. This place is horrible. Alright, lots of stuff here. Take all the guns. I'm just going to drop them immediately. Let's see. Um, this one I keep. This one can go. That's fine. Um, I keep that's one is better so let's get rid of this one and yeah we're good to go I think oh we have this but this is a raider stuff I don't like raider stuff all right let's continue let's continue and go to turpine's bluff which should be this way all right let's go a little bit of a run. Is this red right still here? Probably he is. Yeah, there he is. Take his meat as well. And probably... Yeah. She does so well with the shotgun for these bastards. I think there's another one. Yep, it's in here. Uh-oh. Oh, this is not good. Shoot, 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 shoot. This is not good, man. This is not good. This is not good. good. He didn't sting me. Wow. All right. Oh. Being hit in melee generates a stealth field for... I've never seen this before. That is... I mentioned this in my last comment to uh, Arcane Hermithood. And I've been playing this game for over 850 hours. I've never had this one before. It's really good as well. Oh my goodness. That is such a nice stat. Wow. All right. Well, I need to go to get to a save point. Somewhere where I can save the game. Because on survival you need to sleep. Or on exit, but that's useless. Um, need to sleep to save the game. Alright, we have to deal here with a mole rat and probably a dog. There he is. Not sure where the dog is, but he's close. You probably won't kill me in one go, so I'm not too worried. We're almost at Turpine's Bluff. Let me see those stats again. That's really interesting. Being hit in melee generates a stealth field. Just anyone who hits you in melee, you get a freebie 60 seconds? That's long. Of invisibility? Wow. That's going to be fun. I don't think... Oh. I think the dog was here. <laughs> Alright, now I did this the other way around. Normally you go to Turpine's Bluff. Hello. <laughs> I'm a little bit drunk. <laughs> I love that. Uh, normally you go to Turpine's Bluff first, get the quest, then go to the Corvea factory. Uh, but we did it the other way around. Take it easy. And it should I'm work. With the minute man. I'm here to help. You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders, but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days. All right, whatever. Uh, Minutemen are back. You're rebuilding the Minutemen from the. Glad to hear it. No question. We all know this, so I'm just going to, to skip this. But as you can see, taken care of. I took care of some raiders earlier. No kidding. Right. You know what? I'm going to take. If we want things to get so. 
We're in. All right, they're in. Good stuff. And what we're going to do is we're going to cook up some food. Because that's really needed. <coughs> there you go. So I'm well over encumbered. The crispy squirrel bits, we leave it. Um, what I need is a um, rat stack. Urgently. Someone coming over there. Can't see who. Probably it's Nora, actually. Alright, the mole rats. This opens a little bit of space in our backpack. Leave the squirrel stuff. I leave the squirrel stuff for what it is because I want to have squirrel stew. Eventually, I will get that, but I will save up all the squirrel bits for this. And it gives us another 2% XP, which is really good. Alright, so let's see. Especially when you get the Loversburg from Nora. Yes. I can already tell you it's pretty good. Alright. Let's see, um, let's eat some, let's take some of this, can't hurt, won't hurt, there we go, alright, now one of these guys, I'm going to send away, and I'll tell you to go to Sanctuary Hill and start the supply line over there, perfect, alright, um, now resources are shared among the workstations. And for those who are not really familiar with that concept, what this means is that while building they are shared. Store all junk. Alright, good stuff. Let's see, do we have any bottles? I probably need some more. Um, duct tape. Let's bring the duct tape. Yeah, I think with upgrading items as well, it, everything is shared. But um, you can't see the items in other workshops. This is more what I meant to say. So if you're using the workshop, you can use everything, but you can't see it. But for example, if I want to build some defense over here, I should be able to have some resources, I think. Yes, yeah, not much, but I have some. So, let's place a few things over here. Oh, we, we already run out of oil. <laughs> Alright, good stuff. Let's go. Let's go and activate the compass for a second there. We go this way. Let's have a word with Preston. I think we can... We have some ducks over here. We can get some extra XP. Because this is the thing. I'm testing out the Nora mod, but in order to do this in a normal way, I need to progress really in the game. <laughs> I need to get... Oh my goodness. Better armor. Oh look! So this is melee as well. I'm invisible right now. This is awesome. Whoa. Still see me, and I'm almost dead. All right, I need to heal quickly here. <laughs> uh, but that was pretty cool. Uh, let's take some of these. That will do. So went invisible there. Um, I think the thing to remember. Oh my goodness, that scared me. I think there's another dog. There he is. Notice anything suspicious? That way. This can't be good. Well, Nora, Dude. use your shotgun. Yeah, I need to use vats, I think. I think that's the best. Ooh, my knees. Yeah. When I'm turning invisible. Because this was pretty hard to aim, to be honest. Alright, let's go. I haven't been by... The Olivia thing here as well. And... I have to be careful here with the exploding mole rat. There's a backstory to that as well about the mole rats with the mine on their back. It's actually someone doing that and I think the mole red here but that's just my theory escaped 
from Boston where they were created. All right. Um, we're not going to do it now, but I'm just going to discover the place. This part doesn't have to do have doesn't have anything to do with um, the main storyline, and this character build is main storyline build with side quests and things we come across, but this uh, I don't really count as coming across to be honest. Um, but when we go south and head to Diamond City, yeah, we will come across a few things. Which we will clear, get some good loot, and um, XP of course, so we can continue leveling up. And prepare for meeting Kalak for example, and more, many more other things related to the Institute. I, th I think there should be more Mulrits over here. I haven't been here at all. Which is normally one of the first things I'll check out. Right there they are. Yeah, can I do this? Will that work? Got one. That is good. <laughs> Alright. Let's get the other mole rats as well. I can use the food. Right. Here. Oops. I'm invisible again. It's a little bit of getting used to. I think that's all of them. This is weird. But I'll do my better, best to get used to that. There you go. I need your meat. And there should be another dog here. I want to slow it down with my bullets, the 10 millimeter. I don't have that many left, so yeah. Maybe I need another primary gun. Could do a 38, but well we'll see all right so preston he's over here let's see where about so he's always walking in the water for some odd reason yeah he's again taking his stroll in the water there you go you know that settlement you sent me to help they've decided to join the minutemen that's great news i knew you were the right person for the job by the way you should have one of these flare guns you can use it to signal for help from any nearby Minutemen. Not much use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. I don't think I ever told you what happened to the Minutemen. How I ended up as the last one. Alright Preston, I'm sorry, not interested. <laughs> I think it's always so rude to do this, but um, it's okay. Alright, so what we're going to do right here is we have this annoying girl named Marcy. Where the hell is she? She should be working here somewhere. Is that you? Yeah. Get a job for you. You go to... What? Yeah. I can't read it. If this message just... Red Rockets? Why not Thurpines Blood? Red Rockets is fine. When you think you're safe, you're not. That's how bye, bye, Mercy. Bye, bye, bye. All right. A few more bits of cooking to do. Build red stack for one. I need more red stack. I'm gonna take care of that right now. All right. Great. But first, let's create a new gun. We have this one. And the very first thing I want to do is put a good scope on it, or a decent scope on it, and then we start on this. I have no oil. Hang on. Did I already clear? I don't actually think that... Heads up. I cleared him. 
dump everything in here. And where is Nora? Heads up. Sure thing. Okay, can't loot all, unfortunately. So let's do this quickly. Lots of beer bottles. That's good. I'm gonna make some purified water with that. Need all the purified water I can get. She's got lots of bottles. Good stuff. Alright, and she got oils once. You can get rid of this. I'll let her keep all the ammo. I'm gonna take that with me. It's no use that I leave the ammo here in Sanctuary, so... Yes, does she have any 10 mil? She got lots of 10 mil. Good stuff. Alright. Let's see then. That's great. Now then, let's try this again. Alright, we need the best we can get right now. Can I... Let me check one thing. Alright, I did level up. I can't do any gun net. Okay, so that's fine. Um, what I'm actually going to do, I think I want to do this. Get that out of the way. It will benefit me at the early stage. So. Alright, let's upgrade this one. Let's give it the best long light barrel. There you go. Give a full stock. That has the best for that already. And we don't need any muzzle. I can't build any compensator. Or all right, and um, this one we can leave behind. Yeah, so we don't need 38 ammo anymore. Uh, so that we don't need a flare gun. Um, this is our new one. Okay, so let's hotkey that. Let's see, you go on number three. Great. All right, this is really nice. The mods can all be left behind that's cool and i think i am pretty much good to go all the meat i can put in here these are all resources that will be shared so this is good um oh and what i do need uh let's see I, I think the beer bottles alone will be more than enough but since I'm not going to get back to this place, unlikely, or it's going to take a long time, I might as well take all the bottles right now. This I don't need to take. This will be shared when I upgrade stuff. That's fine. But the bottles will be basically lost, and yeah, bottles in this game is really good. For if you play survival, that is. Alright. Um... That will do. All right, let me just fill them up. I'll just cut this out when I'm done. All right, I am done. I've got 49 <laughs> purified water bottles. I gave a whole bunch to Nora, so she will take that with her. All right, what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to continue going south. If only one quest active, the Jewel of the Commonwealth, go to Diamond City. But that is for next time. This time, thank you once again to Arcane Hermitud. Thank you, my friend. I really appreciate your comment and I hope you enjoy this episode. More episodes to come. I will do one more recording for sure after this one. And um, yeah, stay tuned for that. For now, have a really great day. I will see you next time. Bye. Bye.